Well, we're really excited about this 2018 class. We've got three kids from the state of Michigan. Two are from right here in our own local backyard. Uh, we've got one in Chicago area, New Jersey, and Texas. So we've got players from all over the country. It's really an important class. And we've got a very good, good team coming back here this year. Um, so they can help add depth, add talent. They can, some of them can immediately help this talented 2018 team. But also, we're going to be graduating a lot of seniors in 2018, and we're going to need these guys along with our, our uh, sophomores and juniors to, uh, to fill in and make a step forward in 2019. So it's a very important class, and we're really excited to uh, have these guys a part of it. We really push here at Michigan State is the academics and high character. I think that's been a huge part of our success here at MSU Soccer. Um, you're gonna go through adversity in the years, and if you've got good culture, good kids, they're gonna find ways to, to break through that adversity. And so that's been an important piece to us, and these seven young men certainly continue that tradition of having uh, very good academic standards and also high character. And then just a Briefly touch base, Julian Arroyo, we're really excited about. Um, he came to our identification camp. He's got a lot of pace, attacking forward, left-footed. Really like the way he works. Um, seems to give himself a very good spot. He's got a nose for the goal. So we're certainly excited to have Julian aboard. Um, Jack Beck is one of those local products. Plays for Detroit, the Crew Academy Wolves, but lives right here in DeWitt. Um, left-footed, exceptional left foot. Great on restarts, free kicks, dead balls. Got a great work rate and he's very versatile. Somebody who's probably been watching Spartan Athletics since he's been uh, a little kid, so we always love having those type of players and uh, people in our, in our program. Um, next we have uh, Davis Hooten, uh, goalkeeper from South Carolina. Um, really excited about him. He's got good frame, all the tools you wanna have in a goalkeeper. Um, great temperament, I think that's a uh, underestimated character for a, for a top goalkeeper, somebody who's very cool and calm, um, competitive, and he's really got that temperament along with some very good physical tools, so we're excited to bring Davis aboard. Farai Mutatu is another local product and is as good as most attacking players that will come out of this 2018 class in the country. He can beat players off the dribble, he can score with his right, left foot, he can assist and set other players up. He's a dynamic player that I think will impact our team immediately and he's had some uh, special circumstances as far as his family and background so he's already been through more adversity than a lot of players um, in this uh, in their age have and so we've got a high character kid who's very talented and we're really excited that he's going to stick around here and play at Michigan State. Our third player from the state of Michigan is Will Perkins. All of these guys play for Lars Richter to Scott Duell with the Crew Academy Wolves. Uh, Will primarily plays uh, outside back, he can play on the left or right side, but one of his strengths is he's very good going forward in attack. Um, he's very quick and dynamic, so he could actually play any position out on the wing. And he's actually even played a little bit of center back, so we're certainly excited to have him, and he's another person who could potentially impact some minutes uh, right away. Uh, we've got Davis Hooten from South Carolina. Oh, I just went over him. Uh, oh, Olu. Uh, comes from uh, New Jersey, plays for the Philadelphia Union. Another dynamic, athletic, outside back who can also play center back. What I really like about Olu is he's got a great competitive spirit. He's a fun guy to be around, and I think his best soccer is certainly ahead of him. He's got all the uh, tools and abilities, and I think when he gets in a very competitive Division I environment, he's going to just uh, rise the occasion and, and keep getting better. Lastly, but certainly not least, Colton Stanley. Uh, out of Texas, uh, center back, and Seminole, I think he's got his best days of soccer ahead of him. He's got a good frame, he's got very good communication skills, he's good in the air, he's very solid on the ball, and those are a lot of attributes that you need in a Division I center back. Um, so we're really excited about all these guys, um, and again, we think they'll be a very important piece um, to continue the success we've had at this program, and so we're excited to, to bring them aboard, and we can't wait for August to bring them here and get them going.